Ya. Hey, I up and you. It's your homeboy Cyber. Uh, at least I hope I'm the homeboy. And today we are playing some Shimun or shit Shimu. I don't, I don't really know the name of this game. So in the last episode, uh, we talked to this dude, and we're supposed to be figuring out who. Um... Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. So yeah, we are supposed to be figuring out um, if anybody in this town knows the mystery of the black car or like whoever was in the black car so let's start by talking to this dude um sorry can't talk now talk to you later okay never mind i'll talk to you nah you busy Thank i'll you. talk to you hey there dio the day of the incident did you see a black car around you know what i was shopping in tokyo that day so i'm afraid i didn't see much of anything Oh man, you useless! Everybody in this town um, I've never seen a black so car. Sorry, I don't like talking to strangers. I see. <laughs> but you just talked to me. Ha <laughs> ha! That's funny. You are racist. What? A black car? Yes. The day the snow turned to rain. Yes, I remember the snow and the rain, but I don't remember seeing a black car. I see. Come on, man. Somebody has to know about the black car. Right, Desan. Yo, how are ya? The day how are you, snowed, buddy? Did you happen to see a black car? Huh? A black car? Apparently it drove through here at high speed. Oh, yeah. I heard something about that. Oh. Uh, what did about you hear? The black car. Did you remember? Yeah, man. I heard about it a couple of days ago at the hamburger place. Something about some black car that was speeding. I wasn't okay, paying so. much attention, so I don't really remember. I see. Ask the owner of the hamburger place. Thanks a lot. Alright, so we gotta look for a hamburger place. And see if they know anything about the black car. Uh, this is a hot dog place, so uh, let's talk to this dude. Hi, Dio. I heard about your father. I'm sorry. Have one of my special dogs. It'll perk you up, I bet. Thanks. I'll have one next time. Anyway, on that day, did anything unusual happen? N no, nothing. I see. Well, if you remember anything, let me know. Sure thing, I will. I feel like he is oh. lying. Hey, yo, keep your chin up, okay? Try my homemade pickles? Uh-huh. No, I don't want no pickles, dog. I don't see no burgers, dog. I guess we could try to go to Adichie's, Chinese or something, or probably the bar or something. They might sell burgers. Hello, Rio. Do you know anything about that black car? Yeah, what are you talking about? Did you happen to see a black car the day of the incident? Nope, I didn't see it. That day we only had a few customers due to the snow and the rain. So you I probably spent most of the day reading the horse racing paper, checking out my odds, you know. I see. Understandable. A black I see. car. Mmm. Shinkichi san, I'll see you later then. Wait a minute, yo. I just remembered something. What? Oh, I girl God. over at Aida Flores mentioned something about it. That she got splashed with mud by a black car driving recklessly. The girl at Aida Florist? You mean Nozomi? Yeah, Nozomi. she's a okay. classmate of yours, isn't she? Uh, yes. I saw her working at her shop today. Right, thank you. Alright, thank you, buddy. You really helped me out a lot. So I gotta look at, um, Aida Florist. Did this look like the flower place? Yeah, you must be Nozomi. Nozomi. Real? Yep. Have things settled down for you, any? Yeah. Nope. <laughs> if there's anything I can do, be sure Stop to Stop lying to these women, yeah. Rio. Tell them the truth. Tell them what's going on with your life, you know? On that day, oh, the snow I, changed to you rain. Keep talking. I heard you were splashed with mud from a speeding car. Yeah. What kind of car was it? It was black. 
and the kind of luxury car you don't normally see around here. Did you see who was in the car? No, Probably I didn't. Not. Oh. It was too fast. But I heard a rumor that Tom had an argument with the people in the car. Do you mean Tom at the hot dog truck? Yeah. Why are you asking about that car? Because no I can't. See you later. <laughs> no. Hmm? Cheer up, will ya? Yeah. No. See you. <laughs> Dude. Me and Rio are not on the same level <laughs> right now. Every time I say no, this dude say yeah. Every time I say yeah, this dude say no. Like, come on, man. Stop lying to these women, dog. Yeah. Yeah. Keep Tom, dancing, you liar. Zomi told me you had words with the guys driving the black car. No, no, I don't remember. Yes, they you might do. Have been the ones who murdered my father. Your father? Please try to think. All right, man. I'll try. All right, man. Those I'll try. Okay. Car, what were they like? What I were they saw like? A guy wearing this weird coat. Weird coat. What kind weird of coat? coat. It Kinda was a cold. deep green. Deep green? Yep, that's the dude. That's the dude. They almost hit one of my customers, so I gave them a piece of my mind. But that man, he gave me this glare. I ain't never seen such a cold stare, man. Do you remember anything else? Nope. Try asking Chinese people about Chinese. See that travel agency over there? They get some Chinese customers. I'll ask around for you too, man. Come by later. Sure. Okay, so Tom is not Chinese. And I gotta ask Chinese people about Chinese. So, let's go ask them. Okay, 628. I think I have to be worried about um, my time here. Excuse me. Yes? Because, um, hold on, let me stop talking to him. I need to be worried about my time here. Something about this game when it comes to time, like, like, think I gotta be home a certain time, or things happen a certain time, like, I mean, all I'm saying is that I just gotta worry about the time when it comes to this game. Do it's you not know a big anyone? deal, but... Why don't you try the go. Chinese restaurant near the drugstore? You mean the Ajiji? Yes? I'm sure their employees are all Chinese. Thank you very much. Ajiji. All right, thank you, dude. Okay, I, 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 chi chi. So it's basically across the street from the drugstore. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. We're making progress, guys. <laughs> so what's going on? Hey, I like that music. Uh, does that mean that it's just basically nighttime? Nighttime? Okay, so some of these places are going to be closed, I realized. Because um, I noticed that they have like a time thing on their door. Like that. 8 o'clock p.m. And uh, what time is it now? Oh, wrong button. Time is now. It's almost 8. So, yeah, I'm able to go in here. Ooh, just in time, buddy. Just in time. Hey. What? What? Okay. Uh, hold on. Yeah. Hey. I have been here. Ah, hey, they don't understand, yeah. I don't know what I'm saying, yo. What? I got grass, yo. I got grass, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, yeah. Uh, okay, let's play the game. <laughs> Cause I gotta be worried about my time. Yes? Are there any other Chinese people around here? Why do you want to know about other Chinese? Uh, nothing, really. Is it something to do with what happened to your father? Yes. Oh no. Not all Chinese people are bad. I understand that. But the only clue I have is that they were Chinese. 
please. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is there anything you could tell me? You say Chinese people around here? But there's quite a lot of them compared to before. We don't really know the newcomers. <laughs> I see. I don't know what I'm doing. Why don't you tell him about the three blades? Oh, the three blades. Three blades? What are the three blades? It literally refers to three different blades that represent three different trades. The barber, the tailor, and the cook. They all use bladed tools. The barber uses a razor, the tailor uses scissors, and the cook uses knives. Ah, I get it. Most of the Chinese who came to Japan were one of the three. It doesn't cost much to set up, so you can start the business quickly. People of the Three Blades also know each other very well. It's a good idea to ask them if you're looking for information on people from China. Who are some of the Three Blade people around here? For the barber, visit Maeda-san. For the tailor, see Itoi-san, who's making patches now. For the cook, go and ask Mampu Cook and Namen. The Three Blade people should know about other Chinese people as well. Oh. There's also another barber shop, the Liu Barber and Hair Salon, but... But Liu Sun's father is in the hospital now. His family's having a hard time. The shop's been closed recently. So, Damn. I should go and speak with Maeda-san, Itoi-san, and Mam yep. Pukuken Ramen, right? Yes. Yes, sir. I see. Thank you very much. Do we got the time to do that? Um, let's see if we're able to talk to the patch dude. Because those other places might be closed. Wait, is this you do it? Yes. Yeah, that's how. I know I'll make a nice patch special order. One with a lot of colors. Maybe next time. Uh, it's, it's too late to talk to him. Dang. I think I know uh, where I need to go. Well, I know where I need to go, but I think I'm able to make it. And that dude was drunk, but don't worry about him. It's the pizza, that's the bar. This might be the ramen place. Okay, is it open? Yes, it's open. Let's go. Let go. Let go. Let go. Let's uh, uh, talk to you. Use, use hey, people. What's up? Got a minute? Some other time, okay? I see. Okay, sorry buddy for interrupting your uh, ramen. I'm looking for any members of the Three Blades. The Three Blades? How do you know about the Three Blades? Well, Tao-san of the Ajiichi told me about it. He suggested I could find out more here. Is that so? My husband used to be a cook of uh, Three Blades. Your husband? Yes, but I'm afraid he's passed away. About the Three Blades? My husband, he died a while back. But I can introduce you to two other people. Who would that be? Yong Sun and Wu Sun. Yang Sun and Wu Sun? They both work at the steel mill, but they're originally Three Blades members. Where should I go to meet them? I hear they go drinking together at night, so... You can probably find them at a bar around here. I'll give it a try. Thank you. Thanks. Now we gotta go to some bars. Excuse me. I'm looking for two men. A young son and a Wu son. What? I'm young. I'm uh... hey. Excuse me, but What's do that, young? you know a Ooh. Chinese man named Lan Di? Lan Di? No, I don't know him. Me neither. I should know I was about told the three blades. Formal members, you might know about three blades. Ah, you hear that at Mampuku Ken Ramen? So Yamamoto san remembered. Ah, the mole near Yamamoto san's mouth is quite sexy. Very nice indeed. If she said, uh, my boy. I suppose we can help. 
We used to be apprentice tailors as three bladers. But we weren't cut out for it. Now we work at the steel mill. Do you plan to stay in Yokosuka long? The yen is very strong. I can make more money working in Japan than in China. I'll work hard in Japan five more years, then go back to China and build a house. I see. Thanks. Oh, did they give me anything interesting? No, they, they didn't. Um, about the... Ah, about the three blades, right? Of all the three blade members in Dobuita, Liu-san knows Chinese people the best. Liu-san at Liu Barber and Hair Salon used to have a tailor shop. He was our mentor. His shop's been closed for a while, but I hear he's ready to open back up soon. I see. Well, thank you. Well, okay, nice. in Trio. I should go home. Um, I have... Yeah, I was about to say, I have no idea when I should be getting home, but... Looks like I'm about to go home now, guys. I feel like I should have went back to that old lady. Like, after I was done looking around. Uh, I guess I messed up, but I guess it's all right. Your son, you're home. Oh, hi, Ine-san. I was worried because it was getting late. Don't worry. I'll always be home by 11 o'clock. I do not wish to nag you, but... Yes, I understand. So, always gotta be home by 11. I guess I'm in this episode right here, guys. Hope y'all enjoyed. If you have, share to leave a like. Subscribe if you want to. I'll see you all in the next episode.